Yo, 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 what it do? It's your boy Mad Greedy, back with another one. And you already know, we got Mr. Tom back. He been, he he did a Dear Slim, produced by Eminem. Is, we, is this a joke? This has got to be a joke, man. I thought M didn't fuck with your boy. He had to throw some serious... If M did this, he had to throw some serious bread for this, though. But let's see what he doing, man. See what Tom doing, man. Like, I know I haven't been... I haven't did his last... Well, I think his last two and shit, but... Man, we here for his... We here for this one, though. So we're gonna take a look at this, see what he doing with it, and see what's popping with the video. Since Eminem produced it. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> Let's go. Dear Slim, I thought you might have heard of me, maybe. Because lately, everywhere I turn, someone's comparing us crazy. I never would have thought when I was bumping Biggie and Pac that I would buy bleach in a box and become the product of shade. But I'm here now. Hi, my name is Tom McDonald. People call me controversial. I'm the one that counterculture follows. Every song I drop's a problem. I offend an awful lot with topics commenting on race and politics. I'm pretty awesome. Dear Slim, I know we're very different politically. Seems like some of your biggest fans are the victims I'm triggering. They're convinced I don't like you, which ain't consistent with history. I was picked on as a kid. And they don't know what Slim did for me But I'm here now And I fight the system just like you Was addicted to pills and liquor And quit them just like you He said We know we are so differently Politically And lyrically <laughs> Cause uh I think lyrically uh, Eminem is Yeah he's better bro So But Yeah politically Yeah That too That too People claim that you hate me, but Marshall, that can't be right, dude. You'd have to hate yourself as well, because Marshall, I'm you. Marshall, remember back when you became Eminem. You changed the world with a pen. Well, now I'm just like you. I don't give a what, saying what I want with my fingers up. Everybody triggered and they think I suck. But I don't give a what, nah, 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 nah. I don't give a what, nah, 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 nah. I don't give a what, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Ooh, Tom, he was a fucking ass, bro. You stupid, man. <laughs> hey, for real. That was how Eminem was, though. He used to just say whatever the fuck he wanted on the, on his track, and he didn't care what y'all was going to think about him. And it made him rich. And that's the same thing Tom doing. Can't hate on him for that. You know what I'm saying? You got to you gotta know you gotta know how to get through the, that window. Man, sometimes you got to play the bad guy. Sometimes you got to play the, the good guy. And sometimes you just got to be, you know, know how to maneuver through the game to get to where you need to get. So, you know, that's what it is. And, uh... Dear Slim, I thought that maybe because you paved the way for me, you might relate to weight that Caucasian rappers are carrying. They're constantly comparing us to you. It's embarrassing. Never gaining their approval. It's just hate we're inheriting. But I'm here now. Go ahead and hate it. Don't hurt. Call me culture vulture garbage. Those are ignorant words. I kill a vulture, cook the poultry in a pan till it's burnt. See, Marshall, I'm just like you. I'm flipping the bird. Dear Slim. Mm. He said, call me culture vulture. Man, here we going with this shit again. All right, look, check this out. Rap, rap is something that black people. That's a part of black people's culture. They, you know, that's a thing. That's that's really they are a thing. But do I feel like anybody anybody can rap? Yeah, anybody can rap. You know what I'm saying? That ain't gonna stop you from being a rapper just because one person don't like you rapping. But it, to me, I feel like, yeah, you can be a rapper. But that don't mean, do you hold all the tools to be a great rapper? That's that's what it comes down to me. Anybody can rap, you know what I'm saying? Like, I see Chinese people rapping. I see Mexican people rapping. I see a whole bunch of people rapping. Like, there's a whole bunch of different cultures rapping, you know? Like, why not? Like... Uh, do you see black people doing martial arts? Yes. That ain't part of our shit. But you see them doing martial arts and shit like that. And it's just like, that's what it is. That's the whole point of America. So, no, I don't care if Tom McDonald rapping. What I care about is where his skills is at. And he have, he's a good rapper. 
but he's not no fucking cr lyricist, bro. Like, it's a difference. <laughs> like, Eminem is a lyricist. He's not just a rapper. You get what I'm saying? Like, Tom McDonald haven't showed me anything to say he's a lyricist, bro. He just showed me that he writes songs and he make good, he make good video music videos. That's what he showed me. He give you entertainment. That's what he showed me. And he's using rap to do it. Is his bars super fucking deep and metaphors and all that? No, they're not. He's just a great entertainer, bro. So, yeah. I just want to give you your flowers. I spent hours memorizing all of your songs in 2000. You were the reason I screamed at all of my teachers. A teen, I needed your CD on repeat and shady space on my t-shirt. But I'm here now. They call me controversial just like you. We're both white, both rap, both of our eyes blue. Screw any guy who tries to say you changed and don't like you. Because in my mind, it's still 99. And I'm you. Marshall, remember back when you became Eminem. You changed the world with a pen. Well, now I'm just like you. I don't give a what, saying what I want with my fingers up. Everybody triggered and they think I suck. But I don't give a what, nah, 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 nah. I don't give a what, nah, 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 nah. Whether you love me or hate me or think I'm crazy. Dropped a hundred grand to get a beat from Shady. I really hope when I bought it he wasn't angry. But I really had to tell him that he changed me. The truth of the matter is without you, Marshall Mathers, I would have committed. Didn't I say... This dude fucking got a beat from this dude. I know he had to throw some bread. A hundred racks? That nigga didn't give a fuck about what the fuck you was doing, bro. Even if he didn't like you. He like, I don't give a fuck. I don't like this dude. He throwing me a hundred racks for a beat. <laughs> fuck all that. Do what you want, my dude. And you put my name on this shit? For sure, honey racks. <laughs> I do the shit too, nigga. Even if I didn't like this dude, which I don't know him not to like. I don't even know him not to to dislike this dude. I don't, really don't care. And I think Eminem feel the same way. He like, man, this dude rapping, and he said he go throw me honey racks for a beat. For sure. <laughs> if you you gotta be the dumbest motherfucker in the world to say, uh, nah, man, I don't want your honey racks for this beat. Suicide before I was a rapper You showed me that I could do it I didn't need to be black Or I know it's stupid But I just had to do my best To say thank you Marshall, remember back when You became Eminem You changed the world with a pen Well, now I'm just like you I don't give a what Saying what I want With my fingers up Everybody triggered And they think I suck I agree somewhat with you When he became Eminem He changed the world with the pen Uh... I agree something, some of that with it, yeah. But don't forget, Eminem was a lyricist. He wasn't just a rap artist, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like it's a lot of motherfuckers out here that that's lyricists and they not they not rap they not a rap artist. They not ain't out here making money through the through the industry because you know they not they not they can't be controlled. You feel me? So yeah, but. Yeah. But I don't give a white nan 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 I don't give a white nan 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 Marshall, remember back when you became Eminem You changed the world with a pen Well, now I'm just like you I don't give a white saying what I want with my fingers up Everybody triggered and they think I suck But I don't give a white nan 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 I don't give a white nan 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 Alright, that's it for that one. Let me tell you what I think about the video. Video was straight. Uh, he tried, it's like a tribute to Eminem, low-key. Uh, at first, I thought you was trolling him, you know, but I see that he uh, he hooked you up with a beat for the bread, and I show, you showing that inspiration from him, which is cool. That's that's cool, man. So, yeah, I give you two thumbs up for the video. That's the negative I can say about it. It was just like, uh, uh, I, I won't say too schemey. Like, it wasn't too schemey, too deep thought. 
like you know what I'm saying it was just like you know whoop de whoop this what happened this is why I became why I started rapping and you opened this door for us so I'm gonna ride on it you know and I'm doing the same thing you doing basically so tell me what you're thinking in the comments and that is it for this one and you already know what I'm gonna ask you to do is hit that like subscribe and the notification so when your boy Matt Gree, upload these videos. You'll get them and show your boy Matt Gree some love because it's number love. Yeah, I'm out.